Hey everyone, we're here at Tracy Avier on this beautiful morning. My name's Jackie, I'm part of our bird show team. And as you probably know, Tracy Avier is closed at the moment. And when we did close, we were right in the middle of our indoor bird show season. But you know, this is the time of year when we're starting to transition our birds outside to get ready for our summer shows. So we're gonna be bringing out some of our awesome birds and just doing a bit of a practice run on their outdoor routines and having a bit of fun with it as well. So I think we are ready to meet our first bird. Her name is Curie. Hello there, my adorable friend. And Curie here's our American Crow. And you may recognize Curie from one of our virtual aviary videos we had up earlier. All of our corvids were running their routine in our outdoor theater. Let's see if Curie here remembers exactly what goes on when we move into the big outdoors. Now, Curie here certainly is a star. She's been flying in our shows for a few years now outside. But you know, practice does make perfect, especially during this transition period. So Helen just handed her a nut and well done there, Curie. Nice job, my little friend. And so what Curie demonstrates in our shows is not just flying, but we also highlight a few natural behaviors so that when our audiences watch their shows, not only does it switch it up for them, keep things fun and interesting, but we can also connect what we're talking about to the bird doing it visually. So with this caching behavior right there, where Curie's putting those nuts in the, that hole, she's demonstrating how smart corvids are by caching their resources for later, and she did awesome on that. But you know, putting nuts into a stump there isn't the only behavior Curie knows. We also picked another variation of this behavior where she's taking something and putting it into something else to show how humans can save our resources. So instead of a nut, now Curie has a plastic bottle. And perfect job, little lady. Well done, my friend. And so what Curie demonstrates in our show is that if American Crow can recycle, we really can as well. So it's a great message for our audiences to demonstrate how easy recycling is. And you can imagine when she gets up close in the crowd, sometimes we'll even have kids hand her those bottles. So they're making that nice up close personal connection with our birds. And how awesome is that? Well done there, Curie. You know, Corvids really are smart. And as she's shown off, she remembers things perfectly. She really is a pro here, but we'll see if Curie wants to head on home. There goes Curie, our little American crow. And you know, the goal here at Tracy Aver in our bird show department is to connect people, get them up close and personal with our birds. Sure, we want them to learn some things, but more importantly, we want them to have them to have fun and have those connections. So you can imagine seeing the smile on a kid's face as they hand a bottle to a crow. I mean, what better connection is that? But these next two birds we are about to meet are some of my favorites in our bird show because of how close they get to our audiences. So I think we are almost ready to meet these next two birds. All right, backstage, let's send them out our way. So this is Ziggy and Bowie. They are our black throated magpie jays. So smaller members of the Corvid family, just like Curie our crow. And you can imagine seeing these two zip and zoom right over people's heads. Oh, it never gets old, especially from a presenter perspective. I love seeing them bob and weave all around people. Now, Ziggy and Bowie did hatch here at Tracy Aviary. Their parents raised them, I know, their parents raised them for a few days. And then we took over here in Bird Show. And when they started in our shows, you know, they were still really young. And they started in our indoor shows, making smaller and smaller flights. And then eventually we got them bigger and bigger. And you know, birds learn the same way people do. So we broke all those behaviors up into tiny little steps. And now these two are soaring and wowing audiences in our outdoor show there. Well done, my friends. Now, when we were working on the uh, choreography for Ziggy and Bowie, I know they spotted our emu Sydney backstage, we had to do a little fancy footwork, figuring out exactly where our trainers need to be. But their entrance and exit there is some of my favorites. They actually release directly from their enclosure backstage. Zoom on out here, wow everyone, and then head back home. 
So hopefully you've loved meeting our Corvids, Kiri, Ziggy, and Bowie today. You know, we are practicing and practicing in earnest. Hopefully the aviary will open up soon, straight into our summer bird show season. So hopefully we'll see you there. Stay safe out there, everyone, and have a great morning.